Welcome guys, welcome to this video and in this video we are going to see order by and group by. So currently I have this project database and we have uh, countries here and all the countries uh, uh, with the some amount set to them. Now if you notice carefully we have Austria with 23 and then we are already uh, also we have it again here Austria 23 same goes with canada we have 21 here and canada is repeating again 123 so what i do i am going to show you first order by so to order it ascend we can order them by ascending or descending we can order by the, any column you can order by amount you can order by country so if you order by amount uh, for uh, for example if you order by amount ascending it is going to be an increasing order now if you according to the number value now if you ordered it by country then it is going to be alphabetical order so let's see so what i do here i say edit select all from countries order by and first we check with amount now go so you can see that smaller amount is on the top than 23 34 43 and increasing order from the numbers it's were ordered that way now if you want to check alphabetically from uh, on the base of countries you just need to pass country and hit go you will see all the countries with letter a are on the top then c then n and u just like that so we can order with any field any column we can even order by id so it is going to be increasing order you can see there you can even uh, uh, order it by created underscore at or whatever time the field you have in your database so in this case i put created underscore at so the first the oldest is going to be on the top and the newest is going to be on the bottom because it's doing it by ascending by default so you can see that time is in increasing order now if you want to do a descending in any of these cases, you just say uh, descending at the end. Now if you hit this, it is going to be completely opposite. You can see that 1625 is at the bottom and 1626 on the top. The similar goes if you change it with any other field. For example, if I just say here country, so we should have USA on the top and the other fields coming uh, upside down the completely. So, we can even define uh, the descending so we can as define ascending if you want to now there is a scenario of group by I wanted to show you an example how group by actually works so what happens is uh, if you notice in table we have Austria twice and we have an amount for each time now same goes with Canada we have two amounts so we can group them so that Austria 23 and Austria 23 becomes Austria 46 the sum of amount from that particular country and that can be achieved using group by now this can be useful when you create an e-commerce website using PHP and you want to group some amounts or group by products or something like that in those scenario this is useful so I'm going to write an SQL query here and that's just to uh, give you an example how group by works however we will see it in the PHP when we will be working on more advanced uh, concepts so here I say select sum and I want the sum of amount and also want the country name so uh, from and then I say the table name which is the countries now we say group by all right now group by country of course because uh, each country and then order by and I want to order by country as well so I can order by ascending or descending in this case I just do the descending now if I hit go okay I made a mistake maybe uh, 
now you can check here it says project countries so uh, you can see that I made a spelling mistake here so you, yeah this is also good for you when you get the error you try to get the um, error what exactly it is it says the countries doesn't exist so we go back there and correct our error so this is country and where I misspelled so it's country all right so hit go now it groups it now you can see that we have the uh, 46 for Austria and 144 for Canada so it was before 23 for Austria twice now it is 43 uh, 46 for Austria once and also it ordered it in a descending order so we have United States on the top then New Zealand then we Canada then I have Australia Australia and Austria so this is how the group by works in some scenarios we will be using it so uh, I hope you got the understanding I will leave this code uh, this query into the description so you can have it or you can try it your own and you can try to change it so hope you like this video thank you for watching and see you in the next one